what's up gamers gamer dad here back for another item shop review it is tuesday july 26th just past 8 p.m eastern standard time in canada which means we have an item shop refresh before i get into it want to give a shout out to two of my latest subscribers dank fat cat and michael Salberg wines thanks so much for your subscribing to my channel and thanks to my other current subscribers and for those of you who have not already subscribed to the channel please do so i really appreciate that support trying to hit that 300 subscriber mark can't do it without you. So without further ado, let's get into that review. As you can see, the Street Fighter items have returned, and tonight we have the Sakura and Blanca bundle. So this obviously includes the Sakura outfit. This outfit has two different styles. It has a, a built-in emote as well. Then we have the Hani Kazi Claw back bling. This is a reactive back bling, very cool claw machine. We have the Blanca outfit, which comes in two styles. Standard Blanca and then ready for business Blanca here also has a built-in emote and we have the Blanca Chan back bling also reactive We then have the bonus stage loading screen and of course the built-in emotes are as follows Sakura's victory sway and The Blanca backflip this will be familiar to all those who played the Street Fighter games in the past so, these items are from the Street Fighter set, Chapter 3, Season 2, and they can be yours for 2200 V-Bucks. As well, we have the Sakura and Blanca gear bundle. This includes the Fighting Tournament Trophy Pickaxe, two different styles. The Tropical Hazard Kebab Pickaxe. Not sure how much damage you're going to do hitting someone over the head with a pile of fruit, but... And then we have the Kayari Buta Glider. Not a big fan of this bundle, to be honest. I don't really look the, like the looks of any of these items, but if it does uh, appeal to your taste, you can get this bundle for 1,600 V-Bucks. You can also pick up the outfits on their own, those pickaxes, as well as the glider. Next up in the featured item category, we have the order bundle. This includes the order outfit, which comes in five different styles. You can either have helmet on, helmet off, and then there's some different visors that you can have. It helps if you turn the helmet on. So you got that. Combat Elite. Radar Scanner. And the Interrogator. So, cool outfit. And it also comes with the Ordered Wingspan back bling. Kind of reminds me of the Transformers, this back bling. You have the Ordered Cutlass Pickaxe. This is not a bad looking pickaxe. And we have the Stealth Surveillance Loading Screen. I love loading screens, and this one's pretty sweet. So these are all from the 7 Set, Chapter 3, Season 2, and this bundle can be yours for 1,500 V-Bucks. As well, you can pick up the outfit, the pickaxe, on their own. Next up in the featured category, we have the Fanatic Outfit from the Team Spirit Set, Chapter 2, Season 6. Comes with the Handbag Back Bling. Goes well with the outfit, good colors. Not a huge fan of this outfit, but it's not too bad. 1,200 V-Bucks for those two items. We then have the Showdown outfit from that same set, Chapter 2, Season 6. Male version, basically. Kind of reminds me of the football players from the Beetlejuice movie, if you've seen the original one. Uh, yeah, it looks it's kind of weird. It's like a demon football player. Then we have the Pokey Pack back bling. I like the looks of that. That'd be cool if that was the pickaxe that came with this and he would unsheath the pickaxe from the back, back bling because that thing looks like it would do some serious damage. Anyways, 1200 V-Bucks for these two items. Then we have the Maniacs Harvesting Tool. You know, this is definitely a nice looking pickaxe. I like it. 500 V-Bucks. We have the Blady Bird Glider. This is a cool glider for sure. Really like this. And it's 800 V-Bucks. We also have the Bloom Outfit from the Plant-Based Patrol set, Chapter 2, Season 7. This is kind of a funny looking one. Not too sure how I feel about the Bloom Outfit. It is reactive, and it reacts to damage. We have the Zoot Back Bling, this funny looking creature here hanging off a, a log or a tree branch. And then we have the Pluxarian Florax Harvesting Tool. So... Apparently my cat likes this, voicing her uh, opinion there. And this can morph into Bloom's arm when both are, are equipped. So 1600 V-Bucks for these three items. We then have the Alien Peepers Wrap. 
This is an animated wrap for 500 V-Bucks. We have the Hasavat bundle. This includes the Hasavat outfit, two different styles. This one looks really creepy, this style. And this, this one, he just kind of looks like a normal Dutch-looking guy. I'm not even sure what this would be. but Then we have the crafted carrier back bling. Goes well with the outfit. Kind of looks a bit weird and awkward to me, but... The tree splitter harvesting tool, cool pick, uh, cool looking pickaxe, two different styles. And we have the shadow puppet glider. A cool looking glider, not really for me, I'm not a big fan of the fish on the front, but it's better than other gliders, that's for sure. So, four items, 2,000 V-Bucks. And as well, you can pick up the outfit, the harvesting tool, or that glider on its own. Next up, the daily items. We have the Arctic Assassin outfit from Season 1, the Arctic Command set. Cool looking outfit. Totally feel like this should be an 800 V-Buck skin. I don't feel like it justifies the 1200 V-Buck price tag, but it is pretty nice looking. Then we have the Terra outfit from the Artificial Evolve set, Chapter 2, Season 2. Outfit comes in four different styles. It's a nice looking outfit. I like the looks of this one. And it comes with the Puma Pack back bling. Cool looking back bling there. Four different styles to go with each of the outfit styles. And these two items can be yours for 1200 V-Bucks. We have the Pump Up the Jam Emote, Chapter 2, Season 7, 500 V-Bucks. Twist Emote, Season 5, for 500 V-Bucks. Survivor Salt Emote, Chapter 2, Season 6, nice and cheap at 200 V-Bucks. And the Have a Seat Emote, Chapter 2, Season 1, 200 V-Bucks. So that is it for new items in tonight's shop. From previous evenings, we still have the LeBron James bundles and items. We have the summer favorites, Lil Whip, newly added from last night's shop. We have the Midsummer Midas outfit, Scuba Crystal, Summer Drift. We have Boardwalk Ruby in the house still. And as well, Beach Jewels, Beach Brutus, Beach Bomber, and King Flamingo. Lots of great summer outfits there. And of course, the Sapphire Hajiri or Hagiri quest pack came out last night. There's actually three really cool and fairly recent um, packs here. So, in terms of my favorite item from tonight, I'm going to go with my number one pick as the Order. And I think my second pick will be Terra. So, comment down below. Let me know what your favorite item is. Let me know if you're picking up anything from the shop. Please drop a like on the video, and if you've not done so already, please do consider subscribing to the channel. As mentioned before, I'm trying to hit that 300 subscriber mark. Can't do without you. Really need your support. So have a great evening. Until the next video, this is GamerDad, out.